Hello and welcome to the UW Cath Lab, uh, where we have had an interventional nephrology program for six years now. It's uh, a program that is uh, nationally recognized, um, and uh, we offer a one-year extra fellowship to the uh, nephrology fellows after the completion of their general nephrology first two years. It's very competitive, but our uh, fellows have an uh, advantage in their selection for that. Um, and I'd like to uh, give you a little bit more of a tour of uh, what we do here. This right here is the uh, prep area. As you can see, it's a very modern facility, uh, less than uh, three years old. And um, the patients usually come here, then the general nephrology fellows or interventional fellows will evaluate their access prior to uh, uh, going back to the lab for intervention. Uh, the key being to try to figure out what's wrong with it prior to cannulation so that you have a sense of what the procedure is going to be and what you're going to do. And that's a very good educational experience. After we see the patient in the prep area, we usually uh, look on our uh, data storage uh, um, computer to see what previous images they had. That helps us very much to try to determine what the diagnosis might be and what the intervention might be. In this situation, there's 100% uh, occlusion of the subclavian vessel. And uh, as you can see in this uh, real-time image, we opened it up and it has great flow. So that would be very useful information uh, in uh, anticipating what the next intervention is going to be when the patient comes back. So this is our cath lab. The patient will be here. We'd be operating uh, percutaneously in this uh, obvious state-of-the-art facility. Um, the advantages uh, and disadvantages to being an in-hospital facility as opposed to an outpatient, most of the interventional programs are outpatient. We're fortunate to have an inpatient facility and that allows us to have a little bit more uh, dynamics in the C-arm and some of the imaging equipment. Our DSA is very nicely tuned and we are fortunate to have access to a lot of different wires, catheters, balloons without any restrictions on what we use. Uh, due to some of the differences in the way that uh, costs are run between the inpatient and the outpatient center.